Well, I think uh, we are on the verge of, uh, of one of the biggest revolutions that we're going to face in our industry. We've been slowly affected by technology on the last 50 years, and our industry was one of the slowest to implement new technology. We've been affected more than 40 years ago by what we call CAP, is Computer Aided Systems, the introduction of computers to our process. And that took such a long period to be accepted and to be mastered. Then a lot of people not even got used to that revolution and then we introduced BIM, that was a new process, a new workflow, not necessarily a software, right? But was specifically aimed at one particular part of, of the process of how, do, how we document and model and how we integrate data into the process. And yet that's one, that was more than 20 years ago and yet we're still trying to make that the status quo. But these two, they were just affecting how we do certain things in architecture and in construction. And now we're facing something brand new that we're yet trying to understand, that is how artificial intelligence can actually help us and, and be introduced across the entire, the entire industry, not just how we do or how we document it. And I think that's the biggest thing coming from um, artificial intelligence. It's not a software, it's not a tool, it's not a platform. It's, it's a capacity that now we have, computationally speaking, to introduce intelligence and smart computing into every single aspect of architecture, construction, engineering, you name it. So it's not a tool anymore. It can be, it can happen to any single process. We can smart and elevate it. We yet don't know what that means. And we're forming, we're actually trying to create the questions that help us guide us through this, through this path. So our future is clearly exciting. This is really uncertain moments. And we, what we need to do as professionals, as pioneers is embrace it, learn it, understand it and understand its opportunities and its constraints and then test it on different parts of the process. It will be good change and it will be bad change in a sense things will change and they have to change and this is our opportunity for to make our industry more sustainable, more human-centric, more advanced because the, we're facing challenges and planetary challenges that we need to solve and this can actually be a massive leapfrog, a leapfrog to, to help us solve these issues. So this is an invitation to all to, to explore together and get messy together on what artificial intelligence is and how it can benefit our industry for the better.